The greatest strength of Stanford American School is the direction that the school wants to go in. Everything is done with an emphasis on improving what we do. So even in physical education, we are working at the moment uh, to reflect on what we've done and how can we improve that in the future. We have 12 different sports we offer, mostly all age groups from grade 1 all the way through grade 12. We're at that point right now that we have over 70 athletic programs going um, without, throughout our three seasons. We have a fall, winter, and spring season with over 20 soccer teams throughout the course of the school year. We have an extensive basketball program and we have close to 200 students on our swim team. So those are our big three, we call them, and we have directors of sports for those. Our youngest swimmers enter the swim team at first grade and we have kids going through 11th grade. The program here is only in its second or third year, so there was a lot of opportunity to grow a program uh, to kind of put my fingerprint on the program and head it into a direction and I know that we can be a very competitive, uh, very good school in swimming and I know the school academically is very strong so it was a great opportunity to meld those two programs together and kind of put my print on it as it goes forward. So I've been all over the place, I've, I've coached at, at a multitude of different levels um, and what I know is I know that hard work breeds success and team play beats individuals every day of the week so that's what we try and and still here and what we're trying to instill here in all of our levels of play. And I think that's a great part about being here um, and being at Stanford is these young people are, are so excited to learn. They're passionate about learning. I, I think our goal here, um, as, we, as we all like to talk about, is, uh, is, is to achieve more than they think is possible. And if I have the opportunity to help a young man get to the next step in their athletic career, then the Final Four is obviously a dream, it's a goal. And if they can think it, I think, you know, we can get them there. Go Stanford! The aim uh, with the Stanford program is to have a structure in place where each uh, student will go through the various age groups and using a curriculum, they will be provided with a framework for all of their development. What we're trying to do is create a thread that runs through every program. So the warm-ups will be the same, the cool-down, the stretching will be the same. Certain drills will be introduced at a very young age and those drills will be built upon as they get older so that uh, a student will never feel out of place once they change uh, age groups. Goals are important but they're just one aspect of many that, that we need to develop for a football player. What is important to stress is that results aren't that important until we reach the later stages of the development. We're very fortunate to have Real Madrid on campus here at Stanford American International School. We're lucky to have them as one of our partners. Our seasons are quite short. By having them on site, our students have somewhere to go to continue their training for the rest of the year. Well, the big part of our academy is focus on the young, young boys and girls. We have different, we are teaching on different ages, from U6 to U14, U16. Our philosophy is based on five pillars. Our five pillars are educational one, social one, technical one, tactical one, and the rules of the game. The big pieces of what we're trying to achieve here at Stanford is a route of progression for our elite level athletes. Our aim is to identify them as young as possible, is to support them in their development so that they can start to move into uh, the elite bracket. We always point to hard work. We very much believe in a growth mindset. Now how far they can go with this hard work, we don't know, but it's that potential that's exciting. We want them to be the Messi's and the Ronaldo's of the world, and we will train them as if they're going to reach that when they hit their mid-20s. You know, to me it's about the experience of teaching, and not just teaching in the classroom, but teaching basketball to young people who haven't, don't get the experience of the actual American athletic opportunities that we have in the States for high school kids. And the, the level of play and, and the training techniques um, that I bring to the table and I'm able to bring to the table is why I, I thought this was such a great opportunity. My feeling is there's an athletic program for every student. Every student can be good at a sport. And my goal is to make sure that we find a sport for every student that wants to participate. We're teaching life skills. You know, you're going to have integrity, you're going to learn responsibility, be prideful of what you're doing, you're going to learn to win and lose with humility, treat others with respect. And I think participating in sports prepares you for the next adventure.